Aberdeen has been at the forefront of hydrogen for, for over 10 years now. And as a local authority, we want to make sure we can work with the public and private sector together to really push forward with that hydrogen agenda. Transport from emissions contribute to about a quarter of the UK's overall CO2 emissions. Aberdeen City Council have been one of the earliest adopters of, of hydrogen and they've used that to help support their, their plans for, for decarbonisation. Kitty Brewster was our, was our first hydrogen production station within the city. Right from the beginning um, when it was first developed um, in 2015 to the present day we've had a fantastic working relationship with BOC and um, they've adapted uh, the, the centre there to meet the needs of the expansion that we've had around our hydrogen uh, fleet. BOC can work with, with local authorities and, and vehicle operators to, to deploy hydrogen refuelling stations. Uh, we provide stations that are, are scalable. We've demonstrated in, in Aberdeen how we can do that safely and reliably and, and, and given the the user of those, those vehicles are a refuelling experience which is very similar to what they're used to today with, with refuelling diesel vehicles. I think they're definitely healthier to drive. You don't get that sort of backwash of fumes that you sometimes get. Um, even if you're behind another vehicle and it's one of these, it's really nice. You don't get that, that smell. You know, we're looking to go zero emissions in the city centre and these buses will contribute towards that. I've never had any issues fuelling them. Um, I, I, don't, I don't feel unsafe doing it. Um, electric cars don't have the sort of range and, and these vehicles do have a good range on them so it, it seems a good way to go. A hydrogen fuel cell electric vehicle uh, only emits water uh, from its, its tailpipe and therefore if you're producing the hydrogen from renewable energy it can be a true zero carbon solution. As a council leader, I want to make sure that the opportunities and advantages that I've enjoyed in my lifetime in Aberdeen are enjoyed by future generations. Hydrogen can be a real future, not just for our city, but right across the UK.